Hawkward Systems is excited to introduce new features from Camworks 2015. This video will show you a preview of the new tool cutting parameters, as well as some great new display options. So I'm going to start by opening a file that already has some milling toolpaths associated to it. And we're going to work with this first roughing toolpath. So as you can see, we've set our stock material as the T2 under tool seals. So when we edit the toolpath, under our feeds and speeds, we can choose tool, link that to the tool, and then under our tool tab, we can choose cutting parameters. We now have this associate with stock material option. So this is going to associate the stock material to the tool. And under our tech database, under ID number 116, we'll have settings for the tool. So we can cancel out of this and open the database. Find tool number 116. And on the far right hand side, we can see that we have a feeds and speeds cutting parameters option. So within this option, we now have stock material groups with associated feeds and speeds. You'll see as I click on the different groups, you'll have different feeds and speeds. You can add in new groups and associate your own feeds and speeds. This is a nice new feature in Camworks 2015. We also have a new display option inside your machine definition under the tool crib where you select a tool and you can now see a, a nice display of the tool on the right hand side. So you can show the dimensions of the tool and you can also play with the display options for the tool and the holder. This is just a sample of some of the many features that will be available in the new Camworks 2015. Please see the Hawkard Systems website for more information on Camworks 2015 as well as event information for the new software rollouts.